dinner spot at Kyunghee Herbal Soup. I was originally drawn to this place because when I was planning all of our food spots, I saw this Chinese chicken herbal soup in a coconut. And I was like, I have to get that. Now that we're here, unfortunately, they're sold out. And I see everyone around me having it, so I think they just sold out. But it's okay, they have other herbal soups that we're gonna try. So we got cooked lettuce with oyster sauce. Two chicken herbal soups here that look so good. Very, very rich. Okay, and then we got um, pork ribs and then um, pork belly with preserved mustard greens. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Really? Ginseng to the max. Yeah. This is so my mom makes this kind of food. You know how much my mom would love this place? That soup we just had, my mom actually makes all the time at home with her own Chinese herb. So it reminded me of her soup. But now we're gonna go to the mall and get a good shot of the Patronus Towers. Yes, I see the reflection of the towers up there. And da -da -da. there it is. The tallest twin towers in the entire world. So gorgeous. I looked it up online and this is now like a mixed use building. There's um, office buildings, performing arts studios in here and other things. Oh, and then this is the Patronas headquarters as well. Need to learn Malay. Oh my gosh, that durian one. at this cocktail, most wanted, pork fat wash by Joe. Serve with Chinese pork jerky, this is so cool. Oh my God, flirt and romance. Okay, look at these first two cocktails. One has pork fat wash by Joe and then the other one has salmon fat washed vodka. Right here, attic. Uh oh. 
Can't get in. Watch your step. Whoa. Good morning, everyone. It is our last day in Malaysia, in Asia in general, actually, because we're flying back to New York City tomorrow morning. So this is really our last day. And I'm so sad because I don't want to leave. I've been having a really good time here. It feels like it's been forever because every day has been pretty jam-packed and we've gotten to do a lot and eat a lot of food. Today's not gonna be any different. We're gonna start our day at a hawker center. I wanna go to my last kopi tiam, have my last like kopi, which is coffee, locally brewed, some toast, eat all the noodles, eat all the good stuff, and definitely get my last nasi lemak, which is Malaysian's national dish before I leave, so. We've been loving KL so far. Um, we want to explore so much more of Malaysia. Um, so we will definitely do that in the future, not in this trip, but we have been talking about how much we love Malaysia and how much we want to explore the rest of the country. But anyways, let's go. I'm going to call a grab and then we're going to start our day. Malaysia is actually known for being a country that has one of the most bird species in the world and I'm so excited because we're going to see a lot of really cool birds, probably one that we have never seen before. There's also a butterfly park but we've been to butterfly park before so we just wanted to come and see some birds instead. first time I've ever actually seen owls in real life, like real ones. Look at this. Oh my god, it's so cute.
unbelievably hot. But also, this is probably why there are so many bird species in Malaysia, is because they thrive in this tropical weather, because Malaysia is a tropic country. There are some of the world's most beautiful rainforests here in Malaysia, so that's why they have such a diverse range of bird species. But honestly, I am melting. I am really just heating up here. To our last cocktail bar in KL. We're going to a cocktail bar called Jungle Bird. It's in this very unassuming strip mall and it has been voted Asia's top 50 bars before. So let's go check it out, have a drink to end our night. Mm -hmm. 